Right boys, what is going on? Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be checking out the new 87 Gulashki Objectives. Simple as, looks relatively easy. If you guys are new, make sure to drop a like and subscribe as well. Check me out on my Twitch. The links are in the description. Without further ado boys, let's get into it. So first of all, you've got to score 8 goals using Bundesliga players in squad battles on at least semi-pro difficulty or division rivals. Now for this one, it's not in separate matches. So what I would simply do is go into a squad battles game on semi-pro. Pro, play a really low rated team in squad battles because you do get a selection of four each time i'll show you guys more about that shortly but all you want to do is try score eight goals in one match with your bundesliga player and you'll get that done or maybe it'll take you a couple matches there's no necessary time limit on it because when you've got stuff like this you have to win six matches in squad battles on at least semi pro so you could do two birds with one stone do it in squad battles or do it in rivals. It is completely up to you. This one is assist four goals using defenders in squad battles on at least semi-pro or once again, division rivals. Now, I will show you guys in tip number one what I would do for the assist with defenders. Um, I'll, I'll actually show you an example what I do for it. It is incredibly easy to do and trust me, it makes it so much easier to get this done and you do not have to worry about passing it to your right back and then running up the full pitch to get an assist. All right, score a finish goal in three separate matches in squad battles or division rivals and to do a finesse goal in case you're not sure here is an example to score a finesse shot all you have to do is press down on the right bumper plus shoot so r1 plus circle if you are on playstation rb plus b if you are on xbox very self-explanatory obviously whilst pressing this you are going to want to aim in the direction you want to shoot the ball Right, so what we're going to do, we're going to start off with the assist four goals with defenders tip, and then we'll jump into the quote-unquote squad builder, what I'll do um, if you do not have Bundesliga players like myself, so on and so forth. Now, when you have your main team, your fullbacks will probably be a little bit different than mine. And the reason I say fullbacks is because they're going to be the players that you want to try and assist with rather than a centre-back, all right? Now, Zambrotte and Cap de Vila for me are very attacking. They're going to be absolutely brilliant to get assists with. So what I will do is I'll go and of a game like this keep it like this that's fine have my left back at left back right back at right back and as soon as i get into a game in fact i'll show you guys in game why not let's do an in-game example as you can see we just loaded up a squad battles game what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to pause it straight away um you might want to change to attacking or defensive whatever formation you use and with your fullbacks you are simply going to move them up more more out of the pitch you can say it depends on formation i'm using a 4-2-3-1 so we're going to be playing cap de Vila at left cam and zambrotta at right cam I'm sure Jarzinho and Neymar go down to the defense, which I mean, if you want to have some more fullbacks on the bench to change that, that's fine. But remember, it's only squad battles on semi-pro, so you should be absolutely fine. But what, what this does is essentially it's so, so much easier to get an assist with a player in a right cam or left cam position than a fullback position. So as easy as that, go into the game, move your fullbacks up the pitch so you can get some assists with them or a higher chance of getting assists with them anyway. Now, as mentioned before, this is what I would do if you have no Bundesliga player because you just need a Bundesliga player most likely an attacker to get your eight goals with so what i would do if you've got a team like this is there's one player that i've got in mind and once again it's only in squad battles sure if you want to do it in rivals the only way i would opt or recommend doing this objective in division rivals is if you simply have a bundesliga attack already that's the only way i'll do it is if you've already got some bundesliga attackers but if not like many people the one player i recommend where is he timo verna big old T timo verna or to say turbo timo there for a second dude it does not matter if he's on no chemistry if you want to get him on at least one chem, get a german manager but once again it's squad battles but timo verna i've just gone for sure he's obviously an 82 gold rear he might downgrade your team visually but he'll still do a job in game good pace good shooting solid dribbling or good dribbling he looks like a solid card we all know it's timo verna he's always relatively good on fifa he's just a good nice cheap 1000 coin bundesliga striker you can use to get your eight goals and then you can just go back to your main team as simple as that. But what, what I would do for the score eight goals with Bundesliga players and assist four goals with defenders is do them in squad battles and then if you want you can then switch over to division rivals. Whilst you're at it as well you can do finesse shots as well I reckon. So try to get the finesse goals eight Bundesliga goals or eight goals with Timo Werner if you're using the same player as me and four assists with your fullbacks and what I'll do in squad battles is simply find a worst rated team as you can see this is the one we just did did that on world class I wasn't really paying attention that was just an example I did back out 
hence why I lost 3-0. Um, but you do get four different selections every time. As you can see, the 67 rated with 14 chemistry is the worst selection. So I would view this, and obviously it's going to be a really poor team. So I'd go ahead, choose semi-pro, and we will 100% be able to score at least 10 goals against this team. We get to eight Bundesliga goals. We get a finesse goal, because I think you need a finesse goal in three separate matches, and you get the fullback's assist. As simple as that. After you've done that game, you will have the option to update your opponent opponents which you can do by pressing square on playstation or x on xbox now i'm not actually going to do this because i do want to play the games and only do this if you do not worry about squad battle points and you do not want to play the other ones um, but if, if you do want to play the other ones, then you'll just get to the next stage naturally. And I still know lots of you guys will be able to beat the 89, the 88 rated squads on semi-pro anyways. But just if you want to do it really easy, play a poor team. If you don't care about rivals or squad battles, sorry, update your opponents, play another poor team, and just keep repeating. Now, that's basically all of the hard objectives done. The score eight using a Bundesliga player, the assist four goals using def defenders, not in separate matches, you can get that done in a singular match, and score a finesse goal in three separate matches, then you've just got win six. As I I said do the eight Bundesliga goals do the defender assist and whilst you're at it you may as well get some finesse shot goals all in like you could get eight Bundesliga goals and four fullback assists in one squad battles game on semi-pro and then you can literally jump over to rivals for the finesse goals and the win six squad battles or slash rivals as easy as that lads all right good luck happy grinding if I have to put a time limit on this or an average time it should take you I'm gonna say maybe 90 minutes an hour and a half which is not too bad all right much love boys it's been your boy Davis and I'll see you guys in the next one. So.